only seconds to go before we're racing. You can really feel the tension. Go, go, go! The field is tightly packed as they head towards the first corner. Alonso leads out of the first corner, and behind him is Michael Schumacher. Next is Montoya. There's real drama around turn four. It's Schumacher! And with that incident over, he's out of the race. Unlucky. Kufa has been caught up in that one as well. That incident doesn't seem to have done him too much harm. Completed, the field looks like this. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Third is Juan Pablo Montoya. Fourth is Fisichella. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Rosberg seventh. And Button eighth. charge now. That last lap time was a 1.14.71. Schumacher can't keep up as he pulls away. The gap is now 1.6 seconds. Lap four of this Grand Prix. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Third is Juan Pablo Montoya. Fourth is Fisichella. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. He's moved up from eighth and Nico Rosberg, eight. He's down from seven.
That's a good time for Michael Schumacher, his fastest tour of the circuit so far. That last lap time was a 114.73. He's starting to get some space between himself and Montoya. He's been lapping around the low 115 mark. The gap is now 2.3 seconds. Schumacher's driving is definitely putting the pressure on. That last lap time was a 114.53. He's opening up a big lead over Montoya. The gap has extended to 2.6 seconds. We're on lap six. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Third is Juan Pablo Montoya. Fourth is Fisichella. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button and Nico Rosberg eighth. Montoya is going well, and that last lap was his quickest so far. That last lap time was a 114.63. He's starting to pull away from Fisichella. He's been lapping around the low 115 mark. The gap currently stands at 2.6 seconds. an improvement for Alonso and his fastest of the day so far. That last lap time was a 114.61. Schumacher can't keep up as he pulls away. He's posting lap times in the high 114s. The gap is now 1.6 seconds. The top eight are as follows. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Third is Juan Pablo Montoya. Fourth is Fisichella. Felipe Massa is fifth, Barrichello is sixth, seventh is Button, and Nico Rosberg eighth.
also continues to pile the pressure on. That last lap time was a 1.14.69. He's pulling away from Montoya. The gap has widened to 3.4 seconds. Lap 10, Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Third is Juan Pablo Montoya. Fourth is Fisichella. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. And Nico Rosberg eighth. continues to pile the pressure on. That last lap time was a 1.14.61. He's pulling away from Montoya. The gap has increased to three and a half seconds. We're on lap 12. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Third is Juan Pablo Montoya. Fourth is Fisichella. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. And Nico Rosberg eighth. Alonso continues to pile the pressure on. That last lap time was a 1.14.6. He's opening up a big lead over Montoya. The gap has increased to three and a half seconds. Alonso continues to pile the pressure on. That last lap time was a 1.14.6. He's pulling away from Montoya. The gap has now increased to 3.7 seconds.
Let's take a look at the current top eight positions. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Third is Juan Pablo Montoya. Fourth is Fisichella. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. And Nico Rosberg, eighth. The battle for the lead is hotting up. Alonso must be due to pit within the next few laps. Michael Schumacher could really capitalize here. We suspect he's carrying more fuel on board than Alonso. So all he needs to do is sit behind him until he makes his stop. He should be slightly faster as he's got less fuel weighing him down. So if he can ring out another couple of laps, he should get past. That's provided he can run a couple of laps longer, of course. Alonso completes a good final sector. The gap between them is now 2.8 seconds. We can see the mechanics preparing from our commentary box window. Michael Schumacher knows he has to respond, and he's doing just that. He's slowly closing in. The margin has shrunk by another 10. Michael Schumacher is breaking down this lead. He's closed the gap by another two tenths of a second. Alonso pits. leaves the pits. It has got quite a bit warmer here over the last few laps and the clouds that were threatening rain have cleared. It looks like the sun will be out until the end of this Grand Prix. Sector 2. The split is up to 23 seconds. We can see plenty of activity down in the Ferrari garage now. Michael Schumacher is building up a healthy advantage. He extends his lead by 0.3 seconds. Schumacher is quickest in sector one. The gap is now 24 seconds. Michael Schumacher pits. Alonso has a good chance of gaining a place here. It's hard to see how Schumacher is going to be able to maintain his place.
let's take a quick look at the current leaders. Fisichella leads. Massa is second. He's up from third. There goes Alonso flying past our commentary position. Michael Schumacher exits the pits. It'll be touch and go as Michael Schumacher rejoins the circuit. But Alonso has won that battle and maintained his position. Last lap was a personal race best for Fisichella. That last lap time was a 114.6. Massa can't keep the pace as he pulls away. He's posting lap times in the high 114s. The gap currently stands at 2.6 seconds. battle for the lead is hotting up. Fisichella must have to stop soon. There is a light at the end of the tunnel here for Massa. If he pits first, he'll be looking to get good in and out laps. The mechanics might well short fill him to keep his weight down. We're on lap 20. Fisichella leads. Massa is second. Button is third. Massa starts the lap well and is fastest through sector one. He's reduced the gap by another tenth of a second. Massa is performing magnificently here. Once more, he's quicker than his opponent. The gap has decreased to 1.7 seconds. Massa is fastest through the final sector. He's closed in on his target by another 0.3 seconds. We can see plenty of activity down in the Ferrari garage now. Massa is performing magnificently here. Once more, he's quicker than his opponent. The gap is down to eight tenths of a second. Fisichella is not going to take it lying down. He's started to push on now. At present, the gap between them is two seconds. Massa is in the pits. Grand Prix, 
Fisichella leads. Button is second. He's up from third. Massa is third. Fourth is Alonso. Michael Schumacher fifth. Montoya sixth. Heidfeld is in seventh. And Raikkonen is eighth. Massa exits his box. Fisichella completes a good second sector. The gap is now extended to 28 seconds. We can see the mechanics preparing from our commentary box window. Fisichella moves further ahead. He's managed to extend his lead by another two tenths of a second. Fisichella beats his opponent in sector one. The gap is now extended to 28 seconds. Fisichella comes into the pits. Fisichella is away. Fisichella moves ahead. Massa just couldn't quite do enough to get by. Here's the current top eight. Alonso leads. That's a gain of one place. Michael Schumacher is in second. He's up from third. Fisichella third. He was in the lead earlier. Montoya fourth. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. And Nico Rosberg eighth. Alonso posts his personal best lap of the race so far. That last lap time was a 114.5. Schumacher can't keep up as he pulls away. The gap is now 3.1 seconds. Alonso continues to pile the pressure on. That last lap time was a 114.4. That shows more pace than Schumacher. The gap now stands at 3.2 seconds.
Michael Schumacher. He's giving it all he's got. That last lap time was a 114.56. That's quicker than Fisichella. He's lapping in the high 116s, low 117s at the moment. It's lap 26 of this Grand Prix. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Fisichella third. Montoya fourth. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is better. And Nico Rosberg eighth. lap time was a 114.83 he's building up quite a lead over Fisichella now the gap is now out to 8.1 seconds time was a 114.31. It's quite a significant lead he's building up over this account. The gap has grown to 7.4 seconds now. Let's take a quick look at the current leaders. Michael Schumacher leads. He's up from second. Alonso is second. Fisichella third. Montoya fourth. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. Heitfeld is in eighth place. for the lead is hotting up. Michael Schumacher has been out on the tarmac for a while. His pit stop must be due in the next couple of laps. So there's a chance that Alonso will be able to pass him after their stops. Seems like he'll be in first. There's a chance if he gets excellent in and out laps and a decent pit stop. Most likely they'll short fill him. Michael Schumacher is quickest in sector one. He's extended the gap by another tenth of a second. His race is over today, and he's not happy with that. Raikkonen was the other driver involved in that. The left rear seems to have taken a knock. With any luck, his suspension will be OK. Alonso looks like he's starting to respond. The gap currently stands at 1.7 seconds. Schumacher knows he has to respond, and he's doing just that. He increases his lead by three tenths of a second. We 
we can see the mechanics preparing from our commentary box window. Michael Schumacher is building up a healthy advantage. He's extended the gap by another tenth of a second. Alonso looks like he's starting to respond. He's slowly closing in. The margin has shrunk by another ten. Alonso pits. Let's see who the top eight drivers are. Michael Schumacher leads. Fisichella is second. He's up from third. Third is Juan Pablo Montoya. Massa fourth. That's a gain of one place. Alonso is fifth. Alonso leaves the pits. It's a promising middle sector for Alonso. The gap's been cut down to 27 seconds. After 32 laps, Michael Schumacher leads. Fisichella is second. Third is Juan Pablo Montoya. Massa fourth. It's speed! That incident certainly hasn't helped his race because he's just retired. Raikkonen was the other driver involved in that. We can see plenty of activity down in the Ferrari garage now. Michael Schumacher knows he has to respond, and he's doing just that. The gap is 27 seconds. Michael Schumacher is building up a healthy advantage. He's extended the gap by another tenth of a second. Michael Schumacher pits. Schumacher exits the pits. Schumacher keeps his opponent behind him. Alonso will have to go around him the hard way now.
let's take a quick look at the current leaders. Fisichella leads. Massa is second. Button is third. Fourth, Michael Schumacher. Alonso is fifth. Montoya sixth. Barrichello is seventh. Heitfeld is in eighth place. is putting the pressure on here. That last lap time was a 1.14.74. That time leaves Button in the shade. The gap between them is now exactly 8 seconds. Massa to pit first, just like last time. We still don't know exactly how much fuel they're each carrying since the last pit stop, and he's still got a lot to do. Massa is fastest through the final sector. Brilliant piece of driving. The gap back to his opponent is now over a second greater than before. Here's the current top eight. Fisichella leads. Massa is second. Button is third. We can see plenty of activity down in the Ferrari garage now. Massa is responding magnificently here. Once more, he's quicker than his opponent. The gap has now grown to 3.8 seconds. has been strong through the middle part of this lap. He has now got another six tenths of a second in his pocket. Massa is in the pits. exits his box. It looks as if the Honda mechanics are preparing for a stop. Jensen Button takes to the pit lane. 
it seems likely Massa will go through. It's a fairly safe bet that he'll be ahead of Button after his stop. We're on lap 38. Fisichella leads. Alonso is second. That's a gain of one place. Michael Schumacher third. He's up from fourth. Button is fourth. Now here comes Massa flying past our commentary position. Jensen Button leaves the pits. Button switches off the pit limiter and scrambles back into the race. But up ahead of him is Massa. If he wants to get past him now, he'll have to do it on the track. Top eight currently looks like this. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Fisichella third. Montoya fourth. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. Heidfeld is in eighth place.
Let's take a quick look at the current leaders. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Pisichella third. Montoya fourth. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. Heitfeld is in eighth place. Look at Michael Schumacher, he's giving it all he's got. That last lap time was a 1.14.76. That's quicker than Fisichella. His lap times have been coming in around the high 1.15s. The top eight are as follows. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Fisichella third. Montoya fourth. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth, seventh is Button, Heitfeld is in eighth place. That's Massa on full charge. That last lap time was a 1.14.63. That shows more pace than Montoya. His lap times are around the mid-115 range. Two-thirds race distance, Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Fisichella third, Montoya fourth. Felipe Massa is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. Heitfeld is in eighth place. The battle for the lead is hotting up. Alonso must be due to pick within the next few laps. Michael Schumacher could really capitalize here. We're expecting Alonso to pick first as he was first in last time. Of course, we don't know exactly how much fuel they put in each car during the last round of pit stops, and he's going to have to push fairly hard. That's a promising middle sector for Alonso. The gap currently stands at 2.6 seconds. Schumacher knows he has to respond, and he's doing just that. He's reduced the gap by another tenth of a second. Here's the current top eight. Alonso leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. Fisichella third. Massa fourth. He's up from fifth. Montoya fifth. He slipped down from fourth. We can see the mechanics preparing from our commentary box window. Michael Schumacher is breaking down this lead. He's slowly closing in. The margin has shrunk by another 10. Michael Schumacher piles on the pressure through sector two. He's reduced the gap by another tenth of a second. Alonso picks.
Alonso leaves the pits. Michael Schumacher piles on the pressure through sector two. The gap is now out to 24 seconds. Let's see who the top eight drivers are. Michael Schumacher leads. Fisichella is second. Massa is third. Fourth is Alonso. Montoya fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Seventh is Button. Heidfeld is in eighth place. We can see plenty of activity down in the Ferrari garage now. Michael Schumacher is building up a healthy advantage. The gap is now 24 seconds. Michael Schumacher is quickest in sector one. The gap is now out to a staggering 25 seconds. Schumacher pits. The top eight are as follows. Fisichella leads. He's up from second. Michael Schumacher is in second. There goes Alonso flying past our commentary position. Michael Schumacher exits the pits. Fantastic effort from Schumacher and the team. He exits the pits ahead of Alonso. Fisichella is driving at full pelt here. That last lap time was a 1.14.81. That's quite a bit faster than Felipe Massa. His lap times have been coming in around the high 1.15s. We're now three quarters of the way into this race. Fisichella leads. Massa is second. Alonso third. Fourth, Michael Schumacher. He slid down from second. Button is fifth. Montoya sixth, Barrichello is seventh, Heidfeld is in eighth place. Fisichella is really turning up the heat here. That last lap time was a 1.14.63. That's considerably faster than Felipe Massa. The gap is about 17 seconds.
take a look at the current top eight positions. Fisichella leads. Massa is second. Alonso third. Fourth, Michael Schumacher. Button is fifth. Montoya sixth. Barrichello is seventh. Heidfeld is in eighth place. As we head into the closing stages of this Grand Prix, Fisichella leads, Massa is second, Alonso third, fourth, Michael Schumacher, Button is fifth, Montoya sixth, Barrichello is seventh, Heitfeld is in eighth place. Fisichella is driving at full pelt here. That last lap time was a 114.63. That's a fair bit faster than Alonso. He's been lapping around the low 116s. With the leaders on lap 53, the top eight looks like this. Fisichella leads. Michael Schumacher is in second. He's up from third. Alonso third. Button is fourth. Felipe Massa is fifth. Montoya sixth. Barrichello is seventh. Heitfeld is in eighth place.
now. His last lap was 115.26. He's made up significant ground on Michael Schumacher in the car ahead. His lap times have been coming in around the high 115s. The gap is now down to 1.1 seconds. Here's the current top eight. Michael Schumacher leads. That's a gain of one place. Alonso is second. He's up from third. Fisichella third. Massa fourth. Montoya fifth. Jensen Button sixth. He's down from fifth. Barrichello is seventh. Heidfeld is in eighth place. turn 13 it's E-Day that's the end of his race today and he will be devastated Coulthard's been caught up in that one as well his left rear seems to have taken some damage the top eight are as follows Michael Schumacher leads Alonso is second Fisichella third Massa fourth Montoya fifth Jensen Button in sixth Barrichello is seventh Heidfeld is in 8th place. Schumacher's driving is definitely putting the pressure on. He's just on a lap of 116.5. He started to pull away from Alonso. The gap has increased to one and a half seconds. Here's the current top eight. Michael Schumacher leads. Alonso is second. Fisichella third. Massa fourth. Montoya fifth. Jensen Button in sixth. Barrichello is seventh. Heidfeld is in eighth place.
Alonso is on a charge now. That last lap time was a 1.14.89. That shows more pace than Schumacher. He's been lapping around the low 1.16s. Let's take a quick look at the current leaders. Michael Schumacher leads. Alonso is second. Fisichella third. Massa fourth. Montoya fifth. Jensen Button in sixth. Barrichello is seventh. Heitfeld is in eighth place. Here's the current top eight. Michael Schumacher leads. Alonso is second. Fisichella third. Massa fourth. Montoya fifth. Jensen Button in sixth. Barrichello is seventh. Heitfeld is in eighth place. Look at Michael Schumacher, he's giving it all he's got. That last lap time was a 1.14.91. That's significantly faster than Alonso. He's been putting in laps around the low 117s mark. The top eight currently looks like this. Michael Schumacher leads. Alonso is second. Fisichella third. Massa fourth. Montoya fifth. Jensen Button in sixth. Barrichello is seventh. Heitfeld is in eighth place. Last lap time was a 1.14.71. That's a faster run than Michael Schumacher. He's been lapping around the low 116s. One of the Renaults is off and into the gravel. It's Massa! The left rear seems to have taken a knock. With any luck, his suspension will be OK. That incident certainly won't help his chances of a podium finish. Sato was also involved in that clash. Luckily, he seems to have gone away unscathed.
Alonso continues to pile the pressure on. That last lap time was a 1.14.91. He's made up significant ground on Michael Schumacher in the car ahead. The gap has now fallen below a second. With just five laps to go, Michael Schumacher leads. Alonso is second. Fisichella third. Montoya fourth. Button is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Heidfeld is in seventh. He's moved up from eighth. And Massa is eighth. He's down from seventh. That's a fair bit faster than Alonso. He's been posting lap times in the high 117s, low 118s. We're now on lap 63. Michael Schumacher leads. Alonso is second. Fisichella third. Montoya fourth. Button is fifth. Barrichello is sixth. Heidfeld is in seventh. And Trulli is eighth. This race isn't over yet. It looks like Schumacher may be passed soon. The gap is now 1.2 seconds. Alonso completes a good final sector. The gap has closed to 0.6 seconds. As we head into the final few laps, Michael Schumacher leads. Michael Schumacher knows he has to respond, and he's doing just that. He's put an additional half second between the two cars. The size of the gap is now 1.4 seconds. Michael Schumacher finishes the lap in fine style. He's opened up the gap by another two tenths of a second. is building up a healthy advantage. The gap has now grown to 1.8 seconds. Michael Schumacher piles on the pressure through sector two. He's managed to extend his lead by another two tenths of a second. This is the final lap for race leader, Michael. 
Michael Schumacher. Alonso is behind him in second place. Michael Schumacher is building up a healthy advantage. The gap is now out to 2.2 seconds. The final lap has begun and Alonso is putting some real pressure on to get past the guy in front of him. There isn't much of this race left, so he'd better make his move soon or it will all be over. Michael Schumacher is quickest in sector one. The gap is 2.2 seconds. Michael Schumacher is building up a healthy advantage. He's extended the gap by another tenth of a second. Michael Schumacher powers across the line to take top spot on the podium. Alonso should hang on to finish second. Amazing day at an amazing location with an amazing crowd. This has to be one of the best attended races in the whole F1 calendar. The Spanish fans love Fernando Alonso and love their F1. It's been a pleasure to be here this weekend and I have to say a big thank you for all that our passionate Spanish hosts have had to offer. I'll leave you with the thought that in two weeks time we arrive at the most glamorous location of them all, Monaco. I can't wait. I hope you'll join us there. Goodbye from Barcelona. We'll see you soon.